Hi everyone, thank you for joining me in this video today and for today's video I have got a bra slash underwear haul for you guys so if you do feel a bit uncomfortable seeing bras or delicates um, then please don't watch this video. I think there's nothing wrong with showing underwear in a video. This one is specifically for um, larger breasts. Although the brand that I did get all this underwear from do cater for all breast sizes, but it's just a store that I personally find amazing bras for larger breasts. Um, I find it very difficult to shop um, in most stores, for example H&M, um, Primark, although I wouldn't really buy my underwear from Primark anyway, just for quality. But I do struggle to find a um, size that fits me very well in stores like that. So the store that I bought all of my um, new bras and underwear from is called Hunker Muller. Um, I will leave their website linked down below. I'm not sure if it's a German brand or if um, the brand have stores in the UK or what countries they have stores in basically, I have no idea. But they do have them here in Germany and they have a great selection of underwear, and um, bras, knickers, thongs, bikinis, incredible bikinis. Um, but I did just get bras and underwear. So I'm gonna go through what I bought. I do wanna say the quality of these bras are fantastic. And because I do have larger breasts, um, I do have to get a really good quality bra to support them and fit um, fit them properly. So let's get into it. I have worn a lot of these bras before so some of the tags are not on them. Um, actually I think I took all the tags off so I don't know how much they were but I will say that the I got four bras and four delicate underwear pieces and the total came to around 200 euros. So they're not the cheapest but they're really really good quality. So the first bra I got I always like to have standard white and black bras in my underwear drawer just because that's kind of the most used colours that I need. I wear a lot of white tops and pale tops so I do need a white bra. I actually want to buy a couple more, maybe in a different style. Anyway, so I got this one. I will tell you that I am a size 34F which in European sizes is a 75F. She measured my chest area and I was 71 centimeters, which is like 32 and a half inches. So at first we did try 32 Fs, but they just, I don't know, they felt a bit too uncomfortable for me. They felt a little bit tight around the back. So I decided to go a size up and I got a 34 F. So this is the first bra here. I mean, it looks huge, doesn't it? But I do have large breasts. Let me just do the clasps up at the back. So this is the first bra here. It's so gorgeous. It has a gorgeous lacy detail on the front. It has a nice thick strap, which is great for bigger breasts. It gives a lot more support on the back. And as well, it has three clasps here. The um, straps are really cute. They have a really cute bow detail here um, and also a nice lace trim. And then it also has a little bow in the middle, if you can see here. It has a really cute little bow with a diamante in the middle. So I just love this bra. I wear this bra the most, I think, which I do need to invest in some more uh, light coloured bras. This one is like off-white. It's not 100% white. It's a bit more like an ivory colour. Uh, but it is really, really nice. It fits me perfectly. The only thing is the straps with the 34. I have the straps on the tightest that they'll go and the straps were still slightly too big for me. So I did have them tailored. I had um, a friend of mine made the straps tighter. They could possibly go even a little bit tighter and then I could use the adjustable strap here to loosen it if it was too tight. So I still might ask her to take this in for me a little bit more. Um, so just be aware of that. If you go up to a 34, I'm sorry, I'm looking down here because my monitor's here. If you do go up to a 34F, um, you may have to adjust the straps. I then purchased the exact same bra in black. I haven't worn this one as much because as I said I, wore, I wear more light coloured clothes than dark coloured clothes. But this one again fits like the other one, it fits absolutely perfectly. I haven't yet had the straps adjusted on this but I will go ahead and ask my friend to adjust the straps. They are just a little bit big and I can't tighten them anymore because they're on the tightest. Again, it has the lovely bow detail at the front here. Nice thick back straps, the three clasp 
uh, at the back, so nice and supportive, really, really pretty bra. I feel, yeah, I feel sexy when I wear these bras. I really like the lace detail, I like the bow detail, it's very feminine. I personally find sometimes with bigger breasts, a lot of bras that cater for larger breasts uh, are a little bit un, um, not unstylish, but a little bit like, oh, I hate saying this, like a granny bra. I don't mean to cause offence to anyone, but I'm always like, please, I don't want to wear like a granny looking bra because I'm still young and I want to feel sexy and um, and these really do make me feel sexy. Next, I have this bra here. I believe this is called a balcony style bra. I'm not 100% sure, please correct me if I'm wrong. But I do believe these kind of um, unpadded lace bras are called balcony bras. Now this one I love. I think I wear this black one more than the other black one. It's still got a nice thick band across the back and it again it has a three clasp um, detail on the back as well. It has the cute bows, the um, straps across the shoulder are actually the same, the same style, the same bow. Uh, but this one fits me better. I feel like I don't have to get anyone to adjust the straps for me on this one. It has a really cute bow detail again in the middle. And this one is just super, super sexy. This lace detail at the front. Uh, this is a nice treat for my husband. <laughs> and lastly, I picked up this really fun fuchsia bra here. This is in the same style as the black one before. Uh, again, very sexy. It has gorgeous, gorgeous lace detail on the cup of the bra and it also has diamantes. I don't know if you can see if it's picking up on camera. It has loads of diamantes across uh, the cup as well. Very feminine, very girly, very, very pretty. I love this one. I actually haven't worn it yet. Again, I did buy this as a little treat for my husband and I'm saving it for our holiday. We're going to Thailand soon. So uh, I'm planning to take this with me as a little treat for him on holiday. It has a real um, nice pale pink bow on the front. Um, and it's just so cute. Still very supportive with the size of the back straps and the clasps. But I just think the colour is absolutely beautiful on this one. Now moving on to the delicates that I picked up. So I picked up two um, lovely little thongs to go with the fuchsia bra that I just showed you guys. And I haven't worn these yet, again I'm saving these for holiday, just so they're nice and fresh and new. So I got my thongs in a size S. And this one was $12.99. I think this was the most expensive out of the thongs that I bought. But they did have a, like a, um, an offer on. I think I got three, I can't remember the offer now. But I got like three for a certain price, so you got it a bit lower. Um, but this one I think I bought on my own just because I thought it was absolutely gorgeous. Um, it matches the bra perfectly. It has the light pink bow on the front, the lace detail. It has diamantes across the front. Um, and it's just really sexy, really feminine. And yeah, I think it's just gonna look like a really gorgeous combo. The bra and thong together. This is the second thong that I picked up to wear with that bra as well. This one was $7.99, so a little bit less expensive. And this one is really cute. It has this kind of seamless uh, material, uh, so you won't see any seams, which is nice if you're wearing a dress. I've got it inside out, have I? Yeah. If you're wearing a dress or something, it's really good to not see the seams uh, or any um, like sticking out lace detail. So this would be good for that. And then it has this kind of like sheer mesh material on the front, really silky, really soft. I think it'll feel really nice against the skin. And again, just as a combo with that fuchsia bra, I think it's gonna look absolutely gorgeous. The only thing this doesn't have any diamantes on it, but I guess this is maybe is slightly more practical that it doesn't have any diamantes on it. But nonetheless, both are absolutely stunning. And yeah, I really love them. This is the next thong that I bought. This one was $8.99. And I really like this one, it looks a little bit different. It has a really, really thin thong part at the back, which I really like. I think that looks so sexy. And then it has three separate, I don't know if you can see, I'm not showing this well, am I? <laughs> and then it has like three separate straps across the back. It has a peach one, a mint green one, 
and a pink one and then the actual front of the thong is mint green I'm not sure if it's coming up on camera uh, but it is a mint green color it has a really cute bow on the front as well um, and it is very lacy and lovely cute looking forward to wearing this and this is the final piece of underwear that I purchased. This is a really sweet kind of peachy pink colour. And again, it has that really thin thong at the back. I have a thong like this already um, in like a leopard print. And it's a bit ruined now because I've worn it so much because I really like how it looks. Again, really sexy. And then it has two separate straps here across the back and a really cute bow in the middle. And then a nice plain front. Uh, but I just think you could pair this with any light coloured bra. I should maybe invest in a matching kind of peachy coloured bra. Also under a nice dress, if you can't wear a bra with a dress or a top and you just need the underwear, this would be a really nice underwear to wear for a night out. Something a little bit special, something a little bit saucy. Having really lovely underwear on can really make you feel sexy and feminine. And to be honest, I wasn't one to invest in my underwear. I've only recently been doing it. I had a huge underwear clip out it was long awaited and which is why I have purchased like 200 euros of new stuff um, but it just makes me feel really good especially like the bras I haven't worn these yet I'm mean, so excited to wear them but the bras because they fit me well and they still look nice and lacy and and really cute and I don't know I just feel really nice when I wear them that is it for this underwear haul I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did don't forget to let me know in the comments below like the video as well by giving it a thumbs up and if you're not subscribed to my channel already please go ahead and hit that little subscribe button I would appreciate it so so much and I wish you all a wonderful wonderful day wherever you are watching this sending lots of love and I will see you guys very very soon bye